Why do we celebrate Christmas? Now the birth of Jesus Christ took place in this way. This part of time, there was this girl named Mary and Joseph. Okay, so I believe the, this is how the story went. Jesus was born in 2006. I think the angel came. He's like, hey, yo, Mary, you gonna have a baby? He's like, oh, okay. Oh, on Christmas! God, God, uh, sent a baby into Mary. God put a baby into Mary, and, and they went to a hotel. God sent angels down to tell her. Mary found out that she was going to have a baby, and an angel told her, Mary, do not be afraid. I am an angel sent from God. Baby, God told you. Joseph, being a just man and unwilling to put her to shame, resolved to divorce her quietly. But as he considered these things, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Son of David, do not fear to take Mary as your wife, for that which is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will bear a son, and you shall call him Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. And Mary surprised Joseph. I can't believe it, I'm having a child. It's okay, calm down. Joseph married Mary, and then Mary surprised Joseph. Christmas and Mary had a baby. Time she went to the market to buy some stuff for the baby. In those days, Caesar Augustus made all the laws. <laughs> Hear ye, let there be a list made of everyone in the whole Roman world. Okay, and then she went to Joseph and said, uh, I'm going to marry you so have a baby. Um, the guy of Bethlehem. I'm walking to Bethlehem. Then I went there, and like, there's no place in here. And then the cows didn't want them in there. There is no room in this tent. Oh, I'm so sorry. It seems our rooms are booked. Our attendance is full. And she had the baby. And it was born in a crib. He was born in a manger. Jesus is born! And then, the yippee! End. He was 24 hours old. Go in the field and run up all the sheep. Bye. Okay. I'm an angel sent from God. And in the same region, there were shepherds out in the fields keeping watch over their flock by night. Time to go see Jesus. And they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the baby lying in the manger. And when they saw it, they made known the saying that had been told to them concerning this child, and all who heard it wondered at what the shepherds had told them. And the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen. But Mary treasured up all these things. When they saw the star, they rejoiced exceedingly with great joy. And going into the house, they saw the child with Mary, his mother, and they fell down and worshiped him. That star, uh, it wasn't there before. Yeah, it wasn't. Before. Yes, it must mean something important. Let's fall. Hey, I'm a broken star. Thank you for staying at my palace. We will keep heading east as we follow the star. It was a pleasure to stay at your palace while we were resting. All right, we're almost there. We only have a couple more miles, and we will be there. Um, let's head that way. Oh look, I see a manger up ahead. The star is right above it. Let's go that way. Okay. Finally, we're here. When they saw the star, they rejoiced exceedingly with great joy. And going into the house, they saw the child with Mary, his mother, and they fell down and worshipped him. And opening their treasures, they offered him gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Oh, here's baby Jesus. He's going to be the king one day. Herod has very 
bad intention. Oh my gosh, I had this like crazy dream last night. It was, it was, it was Jesus, not Jesus, it was God. He told me that we should head home another way. King Herod wants to kill baby Jesus. And being warned in a dream not to return to Herod, they departed to their own country by another way. Now when they had departed, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream and said, Rise and take the child and his mother and flee to Egypt and remain there until I tell you. And when he grew up, he was a good one and he made everyone happy. Had a happy life. Happy birthday to you. Everybody, Jesus likes to move. Oh,